Hi. Hi, this is Miss R, and we're in Bryce Canyon National Park talking about biotic and abiotic factors. You can see here, down here is one abiotic factor. It's snow, and that leads to another abiotic factor, temperature. Here, this is high desert, and it's very cold most of the year. A lot of the moisture that comes down here in this part of the desert is snow. This is kind of a microclimate here in the high desert where you get forest. We have trees, we have some shrubs behind me, but largely this is very a hot place in the summer and a very dry place. Most of the organisms that grow here, especially the plants, are adapted to live without water and survive very high temperatures and in the winter very low temperatures. This is a place of extremes. So it's the biotic and abiotic factors that help you define an ecosystem. Here, the abiotic factors define the biotic factors.